false advertising here. Anyway, for those of you who've forgotten, I haven't mentioned it in a while, if you are a musician out there and you play guitar or, or, or piano, harmonica, or what have you, and you think you can play the blues, well, all you have to do is put yourself on tape and send it to me, and you can hear yourself on the radio. And uh, again, a few things to remind you of. This isn't a contest. If I play your song on the air, you don't win anything except the satisfaction of having uh, a potential audience of 1.5 million listen to you, but uh, and also a good story to tell grandkids later on. But uh, it's a good way sometimes to meet people too. I've uh, had some inquiries on uh, where so and so could jam with this person. So there's a lot of good things to come out of it, even though I don't give you a big grand prize. And the way you do that is you make a tape of yourself, and it can be yourself accompanied only by yourself, or you can get a whole big band together, stuff like that. And you put it on a cassette tape, or if you can, a reel-to-reel -reel tape, or even a cassette will do. Uh, I should say a cartridge, although I guess 8-track has pretty much gone the way of the Mastodon. But you send that to KUCR, Care of the University of California at Riverside, Riverside, California at 92521. That's KUCR, Care of the University of California at Riverside, Riverside, California at 92521. And no, you don't have to play like Robert Cray or anybody else. Just hopefully some competence on whatever it is you're playing. And the last thing really to remind you is that if you're in a punk band or jazz or country and western, what have you, that's fine and more power to you. I wish you all the success, but it does have to be blues for me to play it. So anyway, right now I've got something to play uh, from a gentleman out in New Orleans. And uh, actually he's got family here, and that's why I'm able to play the tape. But uh, I guess it's called Father Silo's Band, and it features... Greg Navale on vocals, George Morrow on bass, Jeffrey Hopkins on drum, and Chris Lopre on guitar. And uh, they recorded this in New Orleans. Uh, of course, a lot of great music to come out of there. And so we're going to give this a listen. I may have some more uh, for you tonight later on. So uh, if you're interested on what your neighbors are doing, you might just want to keep it right where it is. Anyway, we're going to hear one right now called Father Silo's blues. Without the gold, in a small town. <laughs> Yeah. 
And that was the Father Silos Band doing a song called Father Silos Blues. And a rather nice thing, I thought. Uh, not too fancy, but uh, definitely got the job done. And that's a, a pretty good example of what I'm looking for on the show. So once again, if you have something that you'd like to send in, uh, yourself playing, or maybe you even have a friend and you'd really like to surprise them by having some of their stuff play on the radio, once again, that's... KUCR, Care of the University of California, Riverside, Riverside, California, 92521, and it has to be blues, and if you do send anything, be sure you put blues or Robert or something like that on the envelope so we'll know who it's supposed to go to. Anyway, uh, right now I have a uh, blues album review coming up for you, and we're going to hear that, then we're going to get into a set of country blues. So right now... Here I am to help you make your decisions on what records to buy. Well, I was born in a small town. I was disappointed. 